Why and our spoilers Wednesday the 27th of November 2019 Devon won't know what to think at this point, so he'll offer a warning, if Kane is deceiving Devon and was truly involved, he's going to prison. Devon will make it clear that he won't tolerate this kind of disrespect to Catherine's legacy. Unfortunately, it looks like Kane's innocent act is just that, an act. Will Devon follow through on that prison threat? He'll have to make a big decision when Kane owns up to his actions later this week. Over with Kyle Abbott, he'll feel protective of his place at Jarboat. Although Jack Abbott named Kyle go COO with Lauren Baldwin, Kyle will still be worried. That's because Theo van der Wey will get to work on Tuesday. Maybe Kyle will fear Theo could worm his way into a more powerful position. He may want to take Theo down a peg from the start. Regardless, Kyle will fight for his spot at Jarboat and in the Abbott family. Young and the restless spoilers, Jack Abbott will tell his family they all are a part of him. Kyle, Dina, and Abby Newman will then join them, and Jack will note Tracy's dedication and creativity in authoring the book. Everyone will applaud Tracy, and Tracy will have everyone applaud Jack as well. Jack will be in tears and say that he's learned so much from this experience. Next on Y and R, Jack will read about John Abbott, and how he vowed to be the best father he could be after his marriage to Dean Abbott merger on ended. Jack will then flash back to telling John that he's returning to Jarboat. Jack will continue reading about Dina coming back throughout the years and will flash to one of her visits, during which she wanted to remarry John and be a mother to him again. <laughs> Jack will read about Jarboat, and how it was John's firstborn. Jack will flash back to a time when Victor Newman caused trouble at Jarboat, and about telling Ashley that she could not be CEO of Jarboat because she's not a blood abbot. Jack will read about how John would approve of them running the company together. Thank you and see you again.